Okay, so the following two integrals, definite integrals, are actually negative values. And we're going to try to explain why. So the first one is the definite integral of x squared minus 4 with respect to x from negative 2 to 2. First, we're going to find the antiderivative. We're going to add 1 to the exponent, and we have to divide by that. And then multiply by x. Use our bar of integration. And we get 1 third times 8 minus 8. And if we plug in negative 2, we get negative 8 thirds plus 8. And then we have 8 thirds minus 8 plus 8 thirds minus 8. So 16 thirds minus 16, negative 48 plus that is negative 32 thirds. So if we drew a picture of this graph, this would actually help us a little bit more. We have a quadratic function that goes underneath the x-axis because it's shifted downward by 4. So by taking the definite integral from negative 2 to 2, we actually have area underneath the x-axis, which is why our area is negative. 